Children dressed in traditional Japanese clothing were practicing a unique type of archery this day. This trial lesson touched on the basics of yabusame, a type of mounted archery. <laughs> Yabusame archers shoot from a running horse as part of a Shinto ritual to pray for good harvest and help. A little boy was embarked on a journey to become such a bowman. This is four-year-old Ogasawara Kiyochika. He is a descendant of the Ogasawara samurai clan with a history of 860 years. The current head of the family is Kiyochika's grandfather, Kiyotada. His wife Junko teaches members the etiquettes of a samurai family. The boy's father, Kiyomoto, and mother Ayaka complete the family of five. <laughs> Kiyochika attends kindergarten on weekdays. On weekends, he practices mounted archery. <laughs> The boy's father also started training when he was four. At age 11, he made his debut as a Yabusame archer. Kiyochika is following in his father's footsteps. The Ogasawara's family rule says they shouldn't earn money with Yabusame but must preserve the tradition. Kiyomoto works at a pharmaceutical company and practices martial arts on weekdays. On weekends, he performs Shinto rites, including Yabusame. An important event for the family took place last November. It was a ritual to mark the first time a samurai wears a traditional Japanese clothing called hakama. The rite is said to date back to the Heian period spanning from the 8th to 12th centuries. A young samurai jumps off a board for the strategic game of Go in the hopes of becoming a warrior who excels in tactics. While grown-ups were busy with preparations, Kiyochika was having fun. <laughs> Junko was helping Kiyochika get dressed. Grandma had some concerns. <laughs> the hour long event could start at around noon. Five minutes in, Kiyochika began to yawn. The child usually takes a nap around this time of day. His mother and grandfather seemed worried as they looked on. But he was wide awake at the highlight of the event. He changed into a hakama. And he jumped off the board. Junko was smiling in relief. But the ritual wasn't over yet. After 40 minutes, Grandma placed the boy on her lap. He appeared ready to fall asleep any time. But not to worry, his grandparents had prepared a surprise. Kiyochika received a white box toward the end of the event. Written on the cover was a Japanese word that means toy. The present kept him awake until the end of the ceremony. The gift was a radio-controlled car the boy had long wanted. Kiyomoto says he wants his son to think about what it means to preserve a samurai tradition. Kiyomoto 
その道筋というものをしっかりと作ってあげることが大切かなとは思っています。Kiyochika has just begun taking steps as heir of the Ogasawara clan. But he has his parents and grandparents to guide him in keeping the long standing tradition alive. <laughs>